Hello everyone and welcome back to the Allison's Montessori YouTube channel. Today we're going to be talking about a super cool product that every child is sure to be excited about. And by that, I mean Bella Dukes three in a row. You know, when you think wall toy, you got to think why, right? I mean, why create a product that has to be mounted to the wall before you can play with it? So let's look into that, shall we? See, with a product that mounts to the wall, there's never a need to make it available to the children. It's always available. You never have to bring it to the play area, nor put it back when you're done. It's always there, all the time, and never gets in your way when it's time to clean up the room. Now, picture yourself walking into a room that has a few different wall toys mounted on each wall. The entire atmosphere of the room is different. Wall toys, in their presence alone, provide your room with a fun, welcoming, playful ambience through their vivid colors and unique designs. More importantly though, since wall toys are so inviting, you'll find that your children are attracted to them and they will almost always have a small crowd of children around them. Now those are all really cool points, especially when a toy is designed with a child's development in mind. Nothing, and I mean nothing, can make you happier than the sight of your child furthering their own development. I mean, even, the winning, even winning the lottery has to come in second place. Now the three in a row by Bella Duke is one such must-own product. Not just for the house, not just for a classroom, I mean just about anywhere children can be for an extended amount of time. The three in a row is made up of three major parts. The wall game, the wall console, and a deck of ten cards. The way this works is, you mount the wall game with the four screws provided, and you secure the wall console in a convenient location of your choosing. You then place the ten cards in the console, and that's it. As simple as that, the three in a row is now ready for playtime. The idea behind the three in a row is easy to grasp, but the challenge lies in practicality. To begin, you move the front card to the back of the deck, and the very next card that faces you is your three in a row challenge. Each card will challenge you to arrange the nine individual knobs in a very specific order. The knobs are distinguished in three different colors, each color having three different patterns. As simple as the idea may be, the three in a row will push your child's development to the next level. Recognizing colors and patterns to start with, but that's just the simple stuff. We're talking about concentration, logical thinking, problem solving, flexibility of thinking, communication, exchanging ideas, and most importantly, development of those oh so important fine motor skills. The cards come with varying levels of difficulty so a child will be able to see themselves grow as they accomplish higher levels of challenge. And of course, the limits to this product is your own imagination. Ask your child to come up with a challenge idea on the wall game, then to design a card and share it with their friends. You can even give each card a fun challenge name to add to the excitement of each accomplishment. The wall game is approximately 16 inches in length and width, with an approximate depth of 2 inches. The wall console is approximately 7 inches in length and width, with an approximate depth of 1 inch. The product is very well constructed, easy to maintain, and can last many years of use if cared for properly. The 3 in a row by Bella Duke is available now at allisonsmontessori.com. A direct link to this product will be provided in the video description below. If you enjoyed watching this product review and would like to see more reviews like this one, please give our video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Also, if you have any questions about the three in a row, or have an idea about a product you would like to see reviewed by us, please let us know in the comments section below. Until next time, everyone, and as always, thank you for watching.